the knee replacement nowadays is much, much, much better than it was in the past. We're doing a, a very innovative uh, uh, procedure for total knee replacements at uh, Sinai Grace. Uh, and what happens in a joint replacement, you want to obtain two things. You want to obtain alignment, so you want a, a, a straight leg. Because if we leave a leg knock kneed or bow legged, what happens is it's going to put more pressure on one side of that joint and, and, and lead to more wear of the plastic on that one side. Now what happens is um, with traditional methods, we were only 68% accurate in getting up alignment. With computer navigation, we're 98.6% accurate in achieving alignment. In a knee replacement, what we basically do is here's the thigh bone and here's the shin bone. So it would sit like this. So it's actually a very bone preserving procedure. And what we do is we just take little wafers of bone off the end of the thigh bone just to reshape it. We cement on a metal cap. And in the cement, I put two antibiotics, vancomycin and tobramycin, which will leak into the joint for nine months to prevent infection. Then on the shin bone, what we do is we just take about an eight millimeter cut below the bad bone and cartilage. We cement in that tray that goes into the shin bone. Then at this point in the procedure, what we did was we take this computerized disc that has sensors on uh, both sides, and we insert that into the um, knee. And then what that does, that gives us readings of how many pounds per pressure on each side of the knee. Now when a leg is bow-legged or knock kneed, what happens is when the, the ligament on the inside gets contracted or tight, so I know my readings are going to be higher on, on the side that's involved versus the side that, that's healthier. So what I can do is we, uh, with real-time data, I can release that ligament in increments until we have equal pressures on both sides of the knee. Now what that does is now with the computer navigation, we have a straight leg and now we have a balanced knee. It's going to feel more natural and the studies have shown that patients have a higher um, a satisfaction rate they have a higher activity level afterwards, and they're much more satisfied. Then once that's all determined, what we do is we place the actual polyethylene into the joint, and so when you walk, you're walking on the space age metal on the space age plastic, and people do marvelous with it. We're getting a significant number of patients that are coming in at two weeks after a complete joint replacement without walkers or canes and um, with great range of motion, and it's just been a really a revolution in knee replacements. We want to give patients a pain-free knee that they can be active and healthy again with.